Well, welcome back to the live coverage of the Chinese Taipei Masters. We apologize for the loss in transmission temporarily, some technical problems with the broadcasting truck, but we're back live on air. Apologies to miss the introduction for the men's doubles. It's semi-finals day here. We've got Malaysia versus Chinese Taipei. The Malaysian number four seeds up against the Taipei number two seeds in this men's doubles semi final. So, a brief run down there now. Our Malaysian number four seeds, Choi Ka Ming and Lo Juan Chen. Age 26 and 23 oh. from Malaysia. Oh. Opening game, the score is two all. They're up against the number two seeds and home crowd favorites from Taipei. Chen Hung Ling, as you can see there on screen, and his partner Wang Chi Lin age 31 and 22, respectively. Chen Hungling there with that backhand drive defense, turning the shuttle cross court. You can see why this 31 year old with the serve is still very much at the top of his game. The Malaysians have only dropped one game so far this week. That was yesterday in the quarterfinals against very strong Korean opponents, Choi sol and Kim Jae-hwan. Third and final game yesterday was 28-26. To the Malaysians here, so they might well be feeling a bit more fatigued than their Taipei counterparts. <laughs> Chen Hung Ling again showing his dominance at the front of the court. Great awareness, great anticipation. They're currently ranked 15 in the world, this pair from Taipei. Far from their best, just a few months ago, up at number 11. After a win at the China Masters Grand Prix Gold just a few months ago. That was a great victory for them. I remember sat there watching. It was Wang Chi Lin who the younger of the two Taipei players on really fine form that day. Some great attacking power from him at the back of the court. But today so far has been all about this man just early on in this first game. Twisting and turning his opponents. The 
the oldest player out there on court today, if I'm not mistaken. Chen Hungling, age 31. Wow, what defense from Wang Chi Lin on the floor, but his partner not expecting him to retrieve the shuttle and covered the backhand just in case, leaving the open court. What defense from Chen Hung Ling. Well, I can't believe Taipei kept that alive. Chen Hung Ling stumbles off court, exhausted from that rally. Piera on the drop from the Malaysians in the end. And it's Taipei looking more confident out there early on in this match. Fault called perhaps on return of serve. Not entirely sure, but the point goes to Taipei and it's them with the lead at the mid-game interval 11-7. These two from Malaysia, fairly unknown to me. Choi Ka-Ming and Lo Zhuan Chen. They've been climbing the rankings steadily, currently up to 31 in the world. This already one of their best performances to date in senior men's doubles. Semi-final also at the S Indonesian Masters. End of last summer. A win here today for them and a place in tomorrow's final will no doubt be their biggest result to date. They're up against it, they're up against the number two seeds and also up against this home crowd for Taipei. They'll be cheering on this men's doubles pair. Service fault called against Wang Chilin this time. And the ambitious cross court smash from Chen Hung Ling. Drifting far wide of the court. Athletic to get round the head so early. And good accuracy straight down the tram lines. Oh, 
you can see what he was after, Chen Hung Ling. That flick serve down the middle and the crouch defence expecting the attack back on him. Another service error. Wang Chi Lin this time the short serve failing to make the court. Miscommunication between the two Malaysians, both going for the same shot. <laughs> and both pulling out before there was going to be some trouble. Oh, the backhand drive. Long of the court, good anticipation, good connection, but just lacked the control. Oh. Yeah, it's a shame for Lo Xuan Chen. The net shot was open. No doubt would have got the lift he was after. And a good serve this time from Wang Chi Lin, finally. Oh, what a slice drop. Defence again from Taipei. Oh, and again. Well, Chen Hung Ling reads the game so well. He knew where that shot was coming. He was ready. His racket was prepped. He just put too much on the drive. The score 14 18 Taipei in front oh! by well now five points needing two to clinch this opening game. 10 Hung Ling with the kill. He dominated the opening parts of this first game with some impressive men's doubles. And it's Taipei who take the opener with a very impressive performance and impressive scoreline 21 14.
So the Malaysians with a lot of work to do to get themselves back into this match. Outclassed, it has to be said, in almost every area of the game in that opener. Impressive defence from Wang Chi Lin. One, love. Not enough power on the drive from the Malaysians and too easy. Sam Silva. One, all. Very comfortable, Two, one. the pair from Taipei. Home venue, home crowd. Last year's winners, of course. Sam Silva. That win no. last year, oh. still their biggest result of their career to date. They'll be looking to replicate that this weekend. Smash when Chi Lin the power required to make that shot count. Three, and not to sell out your own partner, very impressive. Unorthodox, of course, to go cross court with the smash in men's doubles, unless you can rely on that power and you know your partner's going to cover the straight block. A straight lift return. Four, three. God, what a pickup from Lo Juan Shen. Great reactions. Good court coverage, more in defence than anything from Taipei. And that was a good shot out of trouble. And another service fault. Chen Hung Ling called once again with the high serve. Six, five. Oh. Service not called. Service over. Six, oh. Well, service judge Emi Sakamoto of Japan called into action quite a few times so far in this match. No. It's at least good to see the consistency in the decisions. was 
our umpire from Switzerland, Mr. Peter Mezaros. A very well-respected umpire and a very nice gentleman indeed. Seven, six. Better pressure in the mid-court from the Malaysians. Seven, oh. Good smash across the body of Eight, Wang Chi Lin. Seven. Forehand grip in defence, expecting the straight smash. Good power from Wang from Taipei. That smash of his comes down like a rocket. Forehand cross lift from Chen, I think it was. Oh, but the forehand error from Chen in the end. Seven silver, nine, Lin just pointing to the shuttle, it was very obviously out. So much won in this second game on serve and return so far. Whoa. Yeah, and again, that's better from the Malaysians. Looking more comfortable in the mid-court, those driving rallies than the opening game. the air shot from Choi Ka Ming, I think it was. I'm not sure what the problem was there. He didn't expect that one to come back the way it did. He tried to hit it twice and missed both times. A slight look of embarrassment, but it's irrelevant. It's Taipei again in the lead at the mid-game interval, just by one point this time at 11-10. Oh, the miss hit from Wang, but they get away with it. I think the broken string.
maybe it wasn't a miss hit, just the string broke as he connected. Thank you. Well, 10. Again from the Malaysians turning that one back across court. I feel that's the game they're going to have to try to get into here. Their defence hasn't been good enough when lifting, and their attack hasn't well, been good enough from oh. the back of the court, but in the mid court, they stand a chance. They need to get into these driving rallies. Thirteen, well. Yeah, well played. Taipei. Good anticipation from both men. And a good finish. Silver. Thirteen, all. Over. Well, for the first time, 14, 14. the Malaysians are in front. Service over. Temporarily with that error on the serve. Too many errors 14, we've seen, oh. too many faults on serve. This highest level, you can't afford to get away with that. No. Oh, good net shot. Good judgment. So, Chen with the serve. Serve is over. Few errors from Chen today. Some moments of genius too, four. but he's making the right decisions, just Ready. can't seem to control the shuttle the way he'd like. Fifteen, all. Yeah, that's better play from Taipei. They were losing the battle in the midcourt for a while here in the second game. 16, 15. Just a bit of skill and change of direction needed. Another one from Chen, not finding the court. 16, all. Good net shot from Wang. Sets up the attack and it's an easy push to, kick, to finish. A well-constructed rally. No luck involved with 17, those 
60. pushes, I can assure you. They train very hard to keep the shuttle so tight. No surprise to catch the net tape. Oh, what a great rally, unfortunate for Wang it Service was over. in the end. Seventeen. Oh. He's been looking good round the head with that smash all match. Just lets him down this time. Joe. Uh, Chen. You must be more Umpire Peter Mazaros just having a word with Chen. I think just to keep momentum flowing, just to keep things going. He was a bit slow getting ready to receive serve. Eighteen seventeen. Again, that mid-court provides a much more Eighteen. even battle. Oh. Whoa. 19, 18. and Taipei are going to be kicking themselves if they throw this second game away. Too many errors wow. in the net, too many out the back. Dante, game point, 18. And it's the Malaysians that have found some kind of rhythm. albeit momentarily. Service over, 19, Still game point, Malaysia. To serve from Chen this time and some good defending from Taipei, but the error gives the Malaysians the game. Second Too game many errors from Taipei in that second game. A very different performance to the first. And somehow Malaysian are still in the match. It's one game all. 21 19.
is game three. A change of shirts needed for the Malaysians. Service over. A few practice serves used One. Love. by Wang Chi Lin in the interval. That's a better backhand drive. Much more control. Two. Love. Turn of serve, catching the top of the net, just taking One, the pace off. Two. Service for call. And yet service another over. service fault. Three. One. They're keeping Miss Sakamoto of Japan very busy out there on serve. Showing on the face of Wang Chi Lin. That backhand error into the net. Three, oh. And a fantastic serve from Choi. But he can't replicate it. These points coming thick and fast. Plenty of errors. Four, three. Shot from Wang Chi Lin. The deceptive push turned into a soft block. Five, three. Oh. And the crowd getting Six, behind their men's doubles pair from. Chinese Taipei. Oh, oh. This time last year, the same pair in the final, undone by the Indonesians on that occasion, Alfian and Ardianto. Last year's tournament Seven, played three. five games to 11 points. BWF trial at that stage. And the final went right down to the wire, 12-10 in the fifth. It was well over an hour. And the Indonesians came out on top Eight, on that occasion. <laughs> Taipei pair here looking to put that particular demon to bed. So, Two, one better this weekend. Four, eight. They need to make the final first, of course. This pair from Malaysia putting up much more of a fight in game two. No! No! Seven silver, nine, four, ten. Better serving in this third game Whoa. from Wang. Shame about the forehand layoff. Five, nine. Didn't even make the net.
little bit of miscommunication on the return of serve. Played the deceptive net, but didn't follow it up. His partner had to come in and lift. Gave the attack away. Pressure in the midcourt from Taipei. Ten, six. Ah! And they've done it, a huge cry from Wang Chi Lin. They've managed to with to maintain a gap of five points, taking it into the mid-game interval in the third and the change of ends. They'll be delighted to have a lead at the change of ends, it seems. The far end of the court is preferable. So we're into the 44th minute. Chen Hung Ling with the serve for Chinese Taipei. They lead 11-6 in this third and final game. Wang Chi Lin looking very pumped up indeed. It's great to see. Oh, good defense from Wang. Oh, it's brilliant from Taipei in defense. On a number of occasions, I thought the rally was going to be over, but it just kept coming back from Chinese Taipei. And a huge cry of relief again from Wang Chi Lin. Great cross smash from Wang. Coming into his own, finally, in this third game decider. 47. Good use of the cross smash from Lo Zhuan Shen. We've seen that a couple times, the change of direction into the body. Yeah, it was well left. Just teasing Taipei into a return. hit but they get away with it Taipei the oh! shell still in play again they've come from nowhere under such pressure the error this time from Malaysia 
Yeah, not this time. Conservative attacking from the Malaysians. Nine sixty. Somewhat relentless. It was too much for Taipei on this occasion. But they're still seven points up. Is that net cord once again on return of serve? Whoa! Ah, poor judgment from Chen. So Chen's shoe firmly back on his foot. 10 16 the scoreline. Is there a way back for Malaysia? Whoa! 11 16. Taipei. Here's the angle and the precision in the attacking drives. 17, you can see what it means to Wang Chi Lin. <coughs> Six points in front. Four points needed for a place in tomorrow's final. Yeah, that's brilliant. Great communication, great combination from Taipei, something they've obviously worked at in training. Very well organized. Taking the pace off the shuttle. It's clever stuff, and this is more like it, more like the performance we expect to see from these two. So a simple matter of saving eight match points, Malaysia. Points saved, seven to go. The net call return of serve. And there it is from Wang in the end, the power on the smash. Too much. And a much better end to a game for Taipei than the second. Well deserved victory, perhaps not at their peak but very much enough to secure a place in tomorrow's final. And great for the home crowd, this pair from Taipei, Chen Hung Ling and Wang Chi Lin have come through this semi-final. 21, 14, 19, 21, 21, 13.
Technical Officials March in. 让我们欢迎裁判员进场。Semi-final between Thailand and Korea. It's Tin Isrianet and Pak Garapun Chochuwong up against.